back to my channel. I've come on today to show you a little purchase that I've made and a couple of swaps that have arrived in the post as well. So firstly, I bought some lovely little embellishments off Lisa, who's the Crafting Diva. I'll leave a link to her channel where she talks about the embellishments that she's selling down below. So when I saw that she was selling toadstools, I just, um, I just couldn't resist. So I've bought two little packs of the red and white toadstools and then a little pack of multicoloured ones and a little pack of ladybirds as well. So what I'll do is I'll open, I think I'll open it then just to have a, have a little look. I think I remember, I think it's ten in each. Let me just go over what we have so we get a smaller one. So we want two of those and two of the large ones. In fact, four of those, five. Yeah, yeah, five of each. So you get five of the large ones and five of the small ones. They're beautiful. So well made. I enjoy using those in my projects. So I've got two of the red ones and then the multicoloured and then the little ladybirds as well, which I think are so cute. So I'll leave a link to Lisa's video where she talks about what she's selling because she's selling some other things as well that I didn't didn't buy. I must stop buying. I just can't resist. Can't resist. So they're really useful in my stash. So thank you very much for that, Lisa. Next is a swap that's come in the post from Mel of Melis Makes. So the, uh, there's an outer envelope which I've removed. And I've got this, this little card here. It says, believe in the magic of your dreams. Beautiful. I have this um, paper pad. Gorgeous. With a unicorn on. Lovely colours. And, there, and it says, dear Andrea, hope you're well. Please find enclosed my ATC coins for our swap. Two of the circular ATC coins as well as a 50p ATC coins too. I've also included one of the pentagon, hexagon and octagon ATC coins as well for you to try out and experiment with. Thank you for swapping with me, Andrea. Hugs, Mel, if Melis makes. Wonderful, but exciting. So this, these are the coins in here. There we go. That's a clever idea to actually stick them on a card blank. Wow, look at all of these. Wonderful. So, I will swap. So, there's two 50 pence ATCs. That's a clever idea as well. To keep them still. Wow, she's even backed them as well. Lovely paper on the back. One of those little machines. Oh, I must get one of those. Oh, most, that's beautiful. It says heart. Gorgeous laid up little flowers there and it's got a lovely edge around it. Beautiful. And then the other one, which is similar, which says beautiful on there, which it is. Gorgeous. Lovely colours. Again, what a clever idea to back it as well. Lovely. And then we've got two ATC coins. Again, she's back at that one. Look at that. That's a proper decoupage layered up. It's got a little one underneath. You fill my heart. Beautiful. My nails are filthy. I've been uh, crafting this morning. Gorgeous. And then I've got another round one there. Two butterflies on this one. That one says beautiful. Again, that's layered up. Beautiful. And then these ones, so these, let me look back on the card. So one of them's a pentagon, one of them's a hexagon, and one of them's an octagon. Now I'm not very good with my shapes, so I can't say as I know which one's which there. I'm sure my son, who is an absolute whiz at maths, will tell me, and he's good with his shapes. Oh, that's beautiful. The back's just as gorgeous as the front, though. Beautiful. That's 
that one. And then we've got this one that says kind. Oh, that's a nice stripy background on there. Let's go back to that one. Gorgeous. And then I like this one with the checked pattern on. Beautiful papers you've used here, Mel. Really nice. XOXO. It's like the the uh, Pink Bubble Cards alphabet uh, prompt a while ago. Gorgeous. So thank you so much for that, Mel. And I know you've received the ones I've sent you. I mean, I just sent you the two of each of, of these. So thank you very much for sending these extra ones. And now I have these. I've got the templates there where, where I can try and have a go at making those as well. So, so that was off Mel. And last but not least, I've got this gorgeous swap from the lovely Linda, Linda Pierce, Purple Nana, and I absolutely love this. I'm going to have to take that off there and keep that. I'm going to stick that on my notice board. And I've got some gorgeous washi, which I'll be keeping as well. I have some of this from um, Hobby Craft. Now, I have had a sneaky look in here and I'm absolutely overwhelmed. I mean, to start with, look at that beautiful image on here. Image she's created. This is a picture she's used for a long time, I think, on her as her Instagram little photo a uh, picture on there. Stunning that Linda. Really is gorgeous, so clever. And on the back of here it says, Hi Andrea, sorry for the disappointment. No new toadstool stuff done. But have sent you the only other 80 50p coin ATC ATC and ATC coin set. Also, the day you posted, you were at the Harry Potter Studios and I had just that day finished those, so just had to be for you. A couple of extras to fill the pocket up, lol. You will be sick of my stuff, best wishes, Linda. Never, Linda, never sick of your stuff. Absolutely no way. And wait till you see these. Oh, my word. Harry Potter ones. Oh, now let's start with the top one. This is the one where it was the set. This was the swap. So this one is entitled Bluebells set. So a gorgeous 50 pence there with the fox on and the bluebells in the woods. Beautiful 50 pence coin there. And to match that, we've got a, a badger. And then that's entitled the same, the bluebells set. Got a gorgeous stamp on the back, and we've got a squirrel in the woods and the the, um, the wooden pieces from Hobbycraft. I love the fern. I love ferns, I really do. Beautiful. So that was the little set that we arranged to swap. But then on top of that, we've got now with each of the fifty pence coins in the back. It's like a little inchy, which has got very small writing and relates to each of the, I don't know if anyone knows about Harry Potter, but each of the houses, so Gryffindor. It says, you might belong in Gryffindor, where dwelt a brave at heart, their, during, their, their daring nerve and chivalry set Gryffindors apart. So I think I'll keep these together, although this is more like a little in she. I'm going to keep this is put for Andrea on the back. I'm going to keep that with that. And it's absolutely stunning. So we've got a gorgeous sticker there with the gold. You can see. And then in the background, the paper, it's, it's the uh, Marauders map. I suppose you'd have to be a Harry Potter fan to know what that is. And edged in gold. So that's the Gryffindor. And then we've got. Ravenclaw. And again, there's a little, it's quite small writing. I'm struggling to read it. Or oh, yet in wise old Ravenclaw, if you're, if you are ready mind, where those of wit and learning will always be their kind. I'll leave that one with that one. And then another house, we've got a Hufflepuff. 
and set on the Marauder's map. Another little card here which says, You might belong in Hufflepuff where they are lo just and loyal. Those patient Hufflepuffs are true and unafraid of toil. Really small, you can maybe can read it better than me on the <laughs> camera. And then last not least, my son's favourite house, Slytherin. Gorgeous. And what does it say about Slytherin? Or perhaps in Slytherin you'll make your real friends those cunning folk use any means to achieve their ends. Oh, they're absolutely stunning, Linda. I love those. Wait till the kids see them. Absolutely amazing. And then not only that, there's these two gorgeous ones as well. And these ones are the Clangers. How many of you remember the Clangers? Now, the Clangers have been around a long time. But they, did, they, have, they have, have come back and... My children have seen them as well on CBeebies. The clangers, they thought they were a bit strange, which I suppose they are really with the little noises that they make. But they are quite cute little characters. On the back of there it says clangers. It's funny, I'm a bit in between. I think I'm not old enough to remember them the first time round and obviously too old for this time, but I've watched them through my children watching them. And I'm not going to make the noises that they make. <laughs> so there we go. So that's my absolutely amazing swap. Thank you so much, Linda, for that. And thank you to Mel for that swap as well. And also to Lisa for the beautiful little embellishments. So thanks for watching and I'll see you all again soon. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.